hello viewers warm welcome in this youtube channel question is the two end of a train moving with constant acceleration pass a certain point with velocity u and v the velocity with which the middle point of the train passes the same point is so student very interesting question let this is a train ab and it passes a point let this point is p it is the engine and it is the last wagon of the train let the length of train is l and its midpoint is x here it is moving with the passing this point with velocity u and the end point passes this point with velocity b so the distance covered in passing the point equal to l so using b square equal to u square plus 2 al e is the acceleration which is constant for both the point so v square minus u square equal to 2 al or a equal to v square minus u square upon 2 l now let this point x which is midpoint so this is ly2 ax is ly2 and uh, velocity of x is bx with which it pass the point p so using vx square equal to u square plus 2a s s is ly2 here so we divide 2 by 2 this is u square plus a is b square minus u square upon 2l into l l l cancel we got u square plus b square minus u square by 2 taking 2 in numerator and denominator so this is 2 square 2 u square b square minus u square upon 2 so this is u square plus b square upon 2 therefore bx equal to under root u square plus b square by 2 when we take a square root both sides so this is the velocity of the midpoint of the train by which it passes the point p so d is the correct answer of this question i hope you got it please like the video subscribe the channel thanks for watching